You're under arrest. Your noble act just destroyed all the evidence. You're looking at two eyewitnesses who saw you receive stolen property, but that's only the kickoff. We've got you on manslaughter and murder. Book them, Dano. Aloha and welcome to Fit City. I'm your host, Steve Offroth, the health and fitness director for the city of Eugene. And I want to talk to you real briefly about a new piece of equipment that we just acquired called the Power 360. And I'll get back to the Hawaii theme. There's a reason for that. And I'll get back to that in a minute. But first, this machine. This machine is one of those machines or devices that comes along in a generation that can do almost anything for anybody if they're willing to put in just a little bit of work each week. And so this machine is two poles. You can see them here. And they're each hooked up to three pistons. These will move in pretty much any direction you want to move them. It will go in all three planes of our movement. And so that's pretty cool. And it will, however much energy you put in, it will give you that much resistance back. So if I want to go nice and easy, I can do that. If I want to go a little bit harder, I can do that. If I want to go as hard as I can, the machine, this device will give me the resistance that I need. What's safe about this and what's great about this is there's no bouncing, so it's very safe for the joints as well as the ligaments and tendons. It has smooth movement, so it's against piston resistance, so the movement will always be smooth. And every exercise, and there's about 30 of the exercises that come with this, and they'll be posted out where the Power 360 will be at, which will be out in the exercise room up by the front in the little nook by the window. And there'll be posters of all the different exercises on the wall right to your right up there. And I will have a workout of the week put up there for people who want to come in and give this a whirl and see what it's all about. Now the cool thing about this and the, the really nifty thing about this is every single exercise you do with this, it activates the core muscles. And so we have 28 muscles that make up the core. And so no matter what exercise I'm doing, no matter which movement I'm doing, those core muscles are being utilized. So what's the benefit of that? The most powerful benefit of that is gonna reduce your risk of a low back injury. And so that's the greatest thing about this, as well as exercising a lot of the upper body muscle groups, and you're gonna be stabilizing your lower body with your, with your, well, with your feet into the, into, the, into the platform, and so you get a good isometric workout on the quads, the glutes, the hamstrings, the calves, because you're stabilizing your body so you can do the movements. Now, how can we use this? If you've got four minutes, five minutes, or six minutes, that's all the time that is needed to get a quality workout in this. And I'm gonna provide one workout. I'm give a shout out for the police department. And so that's why the Hawaii theme, because this first work workout is called 5-0. So it's dedicated to the police department. So five exercises, and all it takes is five minutes. So 30 seconds on, 30 seconds rest for five exercises. And if you give 100% effort on this, you will be amazed at the workout that you get. So you can get firming, you can get toning, slimming, you can get muscular strength, you can get muscular endurance, you can get muscular power, and you can also get a lot of cardio in this because when you're working as hard as you can, your cardiovascular system will be taxed to the max and so you'll get cardiovascular improvement as well, even in just four minutes. The research studies are very clear on this. It's kind of like a Tabata or a hit. And so the first workout is 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off. I have other workouts that I've developed for 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. The second workout that I'll put out here is called the ladder drill, and that's gonna be dedicated to the fire department, Eugene, Eugene Springfield Fire Department. So it, most of them, most of, the firefighters have climbed up the, the tall ladder in the uh, ladder extent, or ladder, uh, ladder truck. And so every time, every rung you go up, it's a little bit hard. And so this workout will be every time you go up a rung, you're gonna add a set and it will get a little bit more challenging in the workout. But the first workout is called Bookham Dano 5-0. So I'm gonna go through the exercises and that's why the side view of this, because I wanna show you body position and 
what it will take to do this exercise and it can be done in five minutes that's the cool thing about it come in get a warm-up get, get this done and get a cool down and you're gone so maybe about 10 minutes is all you need to be over here to get a quality workout so what can you do with this I'll show you those exercises in a second so the, most of these exercises are going to be for my feet being side by side that's the first base position second base position I can have one foot forward doesn't matter which one third position I can do these, all these exercises from a one foot base which makes it more challenging and so then you have the full exercise equipment of the whole facility to add in with this so I could do an exercise here for 30 seconds or 20 seconds and I can use a medicine ball a kettlebell a dumbbell a TRX a weight machine a free weight I can go do a cardio piece so the amount of exercises or workouts you can do are endless with this and that's why I'm so excited about this piece of equipment so the first one again it's called 50 bookham Daniel 50 so the first exercise is a double arm push pull so what you're going to see from this is many positions that the police might get into when they're coming in contact with people and having to use their body so the trick on this one is to have no upper body swaying backwards and forwards as you do this so you want to pretend like your body is stuck between two slabs of concrete so there's no movement and the only thing you're going to do is move your arms forward and back so the trick is to stabilize activates the core activates all the lower body and then you're just going to the first one you want your hands the same level as your shoulder same height as your shoulder your feet spread about hip width apart and you're going to be about the middle position of the platform so then I'm just going to push pull and so that's exercise number one just called a double arm push pull and so the harder you go the more you're going to feel it and so great exercise to get you going and the trick again is not to have any of this body movement forward and back do the best you can to eliminate that second one is called the wipe and so I'm going to take put my hands on top I'm going to take the handles left to right so it's a wiping motion I have no rotation in my upper torso so I have to stabilize and then the handles go across to the right to the left and back and forth and you're going to feel this in your hips your legs your glutes as well as your core and again you're going as hard as you can for 30 seconds on 30 seconds off so again the trick on this is to not have any body rotation which is great if you can do it and you try not to do that third exercise is a single arm push and punch or punch and pull and this one you can get some rotation in as you do it so you get a little bit more body action so again the harder you go the more it resists which is awesome and so that's exercise number three exercise number four is the rainbow so you're going to take both handles and create like a semi-circle curve around the body and so you get a little bit of rotation in as you do this and again you're going as hard as you can for the 30 seconds and then you get a full 30 seconds rest so I'll call that one the rainbow so kind of going around your body tremendous exercise you're going to feel it in the obliques you're going to feel it in the glutes again the glute medius the glute maximus the quads and the fifth exercise since the first one is so good we're going to go back to the double arm push pull and so again stabilize yourself try to have no upper body movement and then just go as hard as you possibly can for that 30 seconds so that's the first workout called the bookham dano 50 there'll be more workouts coming and the next one will be dedicated to the fire department eugene springfield and so but all these workouts will work for anybody it doesn't matter who who anybody is these workouts are great and again i'll have a workout of the week up on the window and you'll be able to come in and do that for the time there'll be a gym boss timer you can set that to do the time intervals and again you will not believe the workout that you will get on this piece of equipment in four five or as little as six minutes so that's it for fit city i'll see you later